<laughs> Here's where I'm the asshole. Um, am I the asshole for being too honest to a random child? So um, let me cut through the bullshit. 29 year old female par- paralyzed from the chest down. Uh, I was at the mall and I was sitting out front. Damn, so her tits still feel? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was at the mall and sitting out front waiting for someone while they ran to get the car. A family was walking past me and this girl who was like seven or eight years old goes, what happened to you? But not in like an innocent or a concerned way like most kids do. Uh, and the mom didn't stop her. So I said to her, my boyfriend shot me in the chest when I was 19 and it hit my spine and now I'm crippled forever. And the mom stopped walking and said, wait, really? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm glad you're okay. And as they walked away, she whispered to her daughter and that's why you aren't dating until you're 30. And the mom looked back at me upset because her daughter probably didn't need to hear that. But if you're seven and you ask a stranger for real questions, then you get real answers. So am I the asshole for saying that? Not at all. No, no she's totally right. The mom's a fucking dumbass. The mom's dumb a ass. dumb bitch and the kid <laughs> is getting taught by a dumb bitch. Well, I would love to well, say that. What was to say? To Germany. <laughs> <laughs> His daughter is going to Germany. I would love to be able to do that to some kid. My boyfriend shot me in the fucking chest and that's yeah. why I can't walk. <laughs> well, well, like, what is she supposed to say? Like, like a, a Disney prince stepped on yeah, my back? Yeah, right. Or, you know, like, soften it. What happened, yeah, right? That's her point. I think she's, you know, should I have said it in no, a nicer she's way. totally correct. Yeah, I love it. I gotta see the pictures of this lady. I yeah. kind of like her. She's got, <laughs> she's got cool tattoos of uh, similar lifestyles. She, she has these tattoos of um, locker wheel. Like, um, you're gonna have to watch me play FIFA. <laughs> <laughs> you're not going anywhere, away. dumbass. <laughs> you can't get away. <laughs> Dude, she's super hot. Look at her. She's obviously the one sitting down in the chair. <laughs> yeah, they're both hot. Yeah. Both of those witches. <laughs> oh, damn. Whoa. Sweet. Carhartt hat? Yeah, right? she's hot. The sign of a hot chick. That's, Come that's on. MGK giving the lap dance. Ew. She also has tattoos of I the... I wouldn't of like the, that. Um, oh, well, yeah, yeah, and I'm turning I'd be mad now. about that. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's my weird show. <laughs> <laughs> Get off there, MGK. What <laughs> the hell are you doing, bro? You didn't get enough standing pussy? <laughs> now you're taking my sitting pussy? You need to cripple too? Fuck. God damn it. Yeah, man. This chick's a rocket. Come on. Yeah, she's, yeah. she's hot. I don't care yeah. that she can't yeah, walk. I, yo, she like, can, walking she, is super She overrated. can fucking uh, scar any child she wants in front of me. Absolutely. I'm just going to get hurt. I mean, nice I legitimately, like, out of all, I, I hate standing. <laughs> standing sucks. Out of all the things in the world, I mean, this is I extremely disrespectful to say. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she's yeah. cool, bro. Standing is the worst. But like when I get home, the first thing I do is sit down. After I sit yeah. down, what do I do? I lay down. I don't ever want to be fighting gravity. Gravity's a bitch. You know, you want? Can I say something that's going to be disrespectful to everybody? Please. Always. I've, I've reached a point now <laughs> where when I when I wake up in the morning, I used to be a, a chill. I lay in bed all day. I'm tired of laying down by the time I wake up. Don't you dare. <laughs> for, sure. for sure. I'm like, I'm sick of this. I'm getting Don't you dare. I mark this day down, the day that John <laughs> said he doesn't want to stay anymore. I lay until noon. That's, I wake up at fucking 10. I lay for two hours. Just Well, that's... So that's is what, that what we're talking about? He yes, said he doesn't yes, like yes. doing that anymore. No, that's, yeah, now he that, gets up and goes. Well, it's, it's, yeah. uh, now I'm up. Now I'm up at like... I'll, I'll wake up at like 8.30, and I'm out of bed by 9.30. I like that. Oh, so that's, You're still doing an hour. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you yeah. understand how mad people are going to be on this podcast? <laughs> yeah. the people who wake up at 6.30, and they're in the shower by 6.31, and they're out the door hey, by don't, 6.40. Don't get me wrong. I'll pound pod once, watch an episode of Seinfeld <laughs> 2, <laughs> probably, and yeah. then fuck around on my no, you're phone. Still, you're not but tired like, of laying down bro, yet, bro. I would wake up. I would lay in bed for four hours. <laughs> like, yeah. okay. Sun I, starts I, going down. You're like, all right, here we go. Grab Time to start the day. <laughs> I gotta start the day. Chipotle. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> yeah, I'm basically I'm basically at 8:30, 8:45 wake up, 9:30, 9:45 out of bed. <laughs> it's basically where I'm at now. I think that's pretty good. <laughs> I know, but you know, like Dude, how many people yeah, are people gonna hate that? Have, that work <laughs> shitty job. That yeah. work hard. Oh yeah, yeah. People, people with jobs. It's you always mean? your setting. Though, like, so I had you, real. You said jobs. something the other day that um, I got a decent amount of feedback on, where you were like. You said something about starting the day at ten thirty, but like you wanted. Oh, it was, it was, it was, the other day you said Pretty something good like. Start time. <laughs> you, you, you said like I, I haven't been late to anything in a while, and I was like, "Are we being honest about that?" And you were like, "Yeah, no, dude, I've been waking up early. I'm up at like nine thirty. Yeah, and nine thirty. I'm out of bed, baby. <laughs> and the amount of people who were like, "That's as early as it gets." Yeah, but the, the people who get mad about that shit are so weird. I was like, yeah, we have different jobs. Yes, I don't know yes. what to tell you. Yes. Like, yes. we have different jobs. If if my job called for me to get earlier up earlier, yeah, but but I either have but a different you have to job. realize with that job. Yeah. That you 
your, your, your I job. I leap through that, I knowing I have a safety net of my parents and privilege. <laughs> if I didn't have that safety net, yeah, I'd be a loser. <laughs> it's, it's, oh, yeah. That's, that's about as hard as a nail gets hit on the head, right? Yeah. Oh, that, that safety net I have? Yeah, I can quit any job at any time. I'm never going to be, be homeless. <laughs> we, we've had that argument before. We're like, there's... There, like I, I've, I've made two guarantees in my life. I think one, I'll never die in a tornado. Because if a, if I saw a tornado coming, I would talk, just that's bad. Dude. No, dude, I would, I'll just I think move. I, my, my goal in life is now to get him dead by a tornado. I'll just move. Somehow, I'll just get out of the way. Like I'll just yeah, you're not you're not holding it down in the house. Yeah, I'm not like I'll just I'll just I'll leave. But but yeah. but, but, but those like, things like can drop out of nowhere, dude. Yeah, but dudes, chances yeah, are I know by, the people that could kill by tornadoes. Are, right, I'm so not so going so anywhere. Yeah, yeah. I was born yeah. here. I'm gonna here. die here. Yeah. So it's not quite like hurricanes, but yeah, it's like you're from Mobile. Right. <laughs> like, <laughs> a Fujita Five just happened to drop in. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'll just I'll just fucking get in the car and I'll, I I'll get, leave. Okay, but here, okay, yes, but like. You, let's say you're sitting in your house doing what you know, usually do, and the, and the uh, the news is like, I'll it, also never it's going to be somewhere bad. Tornadoes hit, just to be clear. Yeah, that's the real. Like, I'm, not, I'm not even going to because would you be would you scenario. evacuate your t- your house? Uh, yeah, when, yeah, if they yeah. said like there, you know, a storm's coming tomorrow, there might be some I think some if, tornadoes. I think if you live in New York long enough, that that's coming. Well, in the tornadoes. next five years, they're gonna yeah. be like, yo, this is an actual real hurricane. I mean, we, we're, yeah, we were basically, I mean, I, Sandy, I, was, Sandy yeah. was close. Uh, as, as you said, I think a real one's like an actual category, count. whatever. Yeah. yeah. I no, yeah, we're, we're eventually, this is going to be the worst place ever to live, man. Well, I, Hopefully. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty damn close already. And then we're just going to add like tornadoes and hurricanes. I wish the comedy cellar was somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> That's where I would go. <laughs> like a different state? Yeah. yeah Put yeah, it in yeah. Harrisburg. Where, if, where, where, no, he, you see, that's fucking funny that you say that exact town. Harrisburg's that's, perfect. That's a, so no I've tornadoes, <laughs> no hurricanes, just great people. Just <laughs> salt to the earth. Well, when, Harrisburg. Harrisburg's got to be the worst. <laughs> That's where I'm from. Right? Yeah, Harrisburg rules. I know, but, <laughs> but to claim it's like the number one spot in the you country. You want to live somewhere nice? Harrisburg, Harrisburg Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. <laughs> During the pandemic, when people were like, cities are dead, everyone's flocking out. And the city I would always use as reference is like, yeah, we're going to move to Harrisburg and go to Applebee's. <laughs> what a funny joke. <laughs> By the way, if you go to Harrisburg and go to Applebee's, you have the night of your life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 